Hey guys, um, and welcome to my channel with a new name. I <laughs> I changed my name. I am no longer uh, Katie Boo nineteen seventy nine. I am now Katie YG VIP. Which yes, I've been wanting to do it for a while. I just figured that you know twenty twenty has been such a shit year for everyone, and uh, I'm really hoping twenty twenty one is going to be a vast improvement. And you know, new year new me change is always good so yes i decided to just go for it so i've changed my channel name i just wanted to have a channel name that was a bit more like k-pop related rather than what i had before it wasn't really like representing like the heart of me if that makes sense and yg and big bang are most definitely the the heart of me for sure as much as i, I stand a whole plethora of other groups far too many for my own good and my bank balance but there we go um so yes i hope you don't mind that i did that um i feel like it sort of like represents me a whole lot more so i am a vip i'm a blackjack an iconic a blink and now i'm a two meet so uh yes there's there is always a lot of yg content on this channel so along with a lot of like bts and monster x and lots of boy groups and girl groups that i just love so Yes, I hope you don't mind. Um, again, I'm very sorry that I haven't uploaded anything for a little while. I haven't... Um... Oh, one second. Uh, sorry, I noticed that my, my GD disc was like... He was loving a lie down. So I just yeah had to like straighten him up. So I do apologise. <laughs> um, but yes, I'm not quite sure what my train of thought was. But there we go. I think I was apologising for not uploading any videos. So I basically haven't been uploading videos because I've not really had any K-pop. And also um, something very sad happened to me at the beginning of December. I think it was like the day after I uploaded my last video. Um, one of my cats, um, Apollo, has been a bit poorly for a while. And um, unfortunately we had to make the difficult decision to put him down um, at that beginning of the month. So I... Uh, obviously been dealing with that because he was my baby so I have I have been very sad a bit heartbroken I'm not gonna lie and I miss him terribly um I do have another cat star she was she's actually his sister um and she I think she's missing him but I think she's more excited about all the treats that she's getting all the extra food and all the extra cuddles and uh yes but yeah it's been a bit of a sad sad place our house so um i've been kind of concentrating on christmas and so all my money has kind of been going on christmas and stuff like that i am doing a lot better but i still have my moments but i kind of was burying myself on christmas i'm not quite sure what i'm going to do now that christmas is done but we shall see <laughs> so that's kind of why i've not really been around you would have known that if you if you're um follow me on instagram you should have because i did put it on there that i'm going to be a bit quiet for a while whilst i deal with everything so i do apologize if you've been like oh wonder why she's not i've not had any money either so i've had nothing to really show you until now we have a haul we have a christmas haul i do this every christmas and birthday uh, basically my family give me money every christmas and birthday um and i go out and i buy k-pop online whatever i feel i need the most and then when it comes, they get it and they wrap it up and give it back to me. It's just how I've always done it. So I'm going to show you um, the K-pop stuff that I got. I've got a few like bits and pieces as well, additional. This bag is not K-pop, but yes, I will. I'll share that one at the end. <laughs> um, but before we go into what my family um, bought me, I want to just show you something that a friend recently sent me just before Christmas. Um, this friend of mine lives in London. And um, she and I have become little trading buddies. Uh, we've been friends for a long time. I met her a few years ago at the G Dragon concert in Wembley. Um, and yeah, she's a VIP and she's a treasure, ma treasure maker. I think I'm also turning into a mom baby as well. So that's excellent. Um, and basically, we've been trading a hell of a lot since Treasure. She seems to be getting all my biases and I seem to be getting all of hers. And so we do a lot of trading and I was expecting something from her, but not this side of Christmas. So I was a little bit surprised when this box showed up. And there's a few things in there that I expected and a few things I was not. Young lady, I do not condone this behaviour at all. So especially as I know she says not, it's not everything and she's got me some more stuff. So... I'm a bit worried <laughs> um but i am going to be sending yours out very soon i have a load of stuff i'm sending to her so um it's very nice to have someone in the uk who um i can trade stuff with someone who i trust so that's great so first of all 
I opened it and I was just like, wait, hang on a second. There's, and I was so confused, but uh, so there is some additional stuff in here. So the things I, I can't remember how much I knew, but basically she had some I am luck, <laughs> which I did not. So she pulled these three. I don't know if you can see, this is I am's hollow. And then here's a little, I don't really know what that's called. It's like the, the perforation one and then the little bookmark thing. So she had those, which she, she's traded with me. Um, and then she also had this clear I am card from I don't even know what con what, what come come back this is from I'm not very good at remembering stuff like that um she also sent me this which I didn't know about um so this is like the cards that you get in there there's like a bit of merch that they used to have in one of their dome tours and I've got top and I've got sungri um and she got me Taeyang, so I'm very happy. Thank you very much for giving me this, because I had just bought, I started a Baiyi collection, a, a Baiyi thing. Been, I've been buying on Baiyi. Um, and I did buy GDs, so I saw this and I was like, oh, I hope that's not GDs. But it's Taeyang, so thank you very much indeed. Um, she also sent me this Hyunsuk as well. I think this is part of a trade that I knew about. Um, by the way, she also packages things up so beautifully. I really must film one of her packages one day, because, oh. And then she bought me this Yoshi cup holder thing, which I think was a pre-order in Japan. I didn't know about this. She is also collecting Yoshi. Um, but I guess maybe she had a dupe. I really hope that it's a dupe and not anything else. And also I'm hoping this is a dupe as well. So this is another pre-order Yoshi. Um, I'm not doing so good with pre-orders and stuff. I'm so behind with my treasure stuff, but you know, we will get there. Um, and then yeah, it came in this huge top loader, which I'm very excited about with more to follow. Apparently Parcel Force had other ideas. So yes, but there was also some chocolate in here as well, which I'm, I'm plowing through. So, um, these are hotel chocolate. So this was a bit of a shock because this, this place is not cheap. So thank you. And they are going down very well indeed. So yes i need to finish them off i might have to finish them off sooner rather than later um oh and then one more card <laughs> so you got me a song card from icon i collect songs so we have this one as well so i'm very excited about having all of those so thank you so very much to my lovely friend for sending me all these beautiful goodies um i think my camera's gone all fuzzy now i don't know what my camera's doing maybe it will focus in a minute when i start to show so I will start off with BTS. I got some BTS bits and bobs. So I'm very excited. Um, most importantly, I got B. Yay. Um, it was a bit of a delay in me getting this because of Christmas. I haven't opened it yet. Should we open it? We'll open it. I mean, there's nothing random and stuff in here. So I don't want this to be a long ass video. That's the only thing. There's not really a huge amount to show you. So I might be quite quick with a load of other stuff, but... Yes, I finally have the... I really don't know why they did it like this, to be honest with you, because it's so expensive. I was just like, do I? Do I not? But then I was just like, do you know what? I'm going to just do it. So I actually ordered it off Amazon in the end. Um, they really do like having, like, white stuff. There's no random, like, photo cards and stuff in here, so there's just... I don't think I've got my... Ooh, put my camera down a little bit. What have we got? Track list. There's a CD. Oh, I do love a CD where there's a picture printed on it. That's quite cool. I mean, there's so many unboxings. I'm not going to like, oh my God, look at the thickness of this. Hello. I wonder why they chose to do it like this. With no, I mean, I'm, I, I guess I am thankful that I'm going to look at that properly in my own time because I'm sure you've all got it. And I mean, what's this? Oh, this is like, um, okay, random. And then there's like loads of bits. Now, these are just like, I guess, art photographs. Um, I'm, I don't mean to be like, oh, I think you put it in the frame or something. Um, and then there's this. And then there's like, um, a load of photo, like photo cards with all the members. So they're all lying down. So they're not selfie cards or anything else. It's a bit random. Very un-BTS-like, but hey. But I'm very thankful to have it because I love the album. The comeback is beautiful. It's one of my favourites, actually, for sure. So, yay. Um, another thing that I asked for for Christmas, which is also BTS-related, is this. The World Tour, Love Yourself, Speak Yourself, London. Yes, Wembley Stadium. 
I haven't opened it either. So I was like, oh. I'm not sure if there is a random photo card still in here or anything like that. Um, she says trying awkwardly to open. Oh my God. Why do I never bring scissors to the party? Oh my God. Oh my God. Um, but uh, this was, I didn't get to go to this concert because I went to Florida. But I'm very thankful that I got to go to Florida last year because if it was this year, I mean, there'd have been no chance. So, oh my God, do I need scissors? Oh, no, I got it. Got it. Don't panic. So I didn't get to go to this. I saw them in 2018 and I still want to get that show, but I, it's really expensive now, so I probably won't. <laughs> but I got this one, so I'm very excited to... to to have this one because i haven't even seen this one i'm hoping that it actually plays um so yes i finally have this one I'm very excited um korean english chinese reading code one and three mm, not sure if my blu-ray player my dvd blu-ray player will play this but i wanted it so you know hey ho um so we have, is this the DVD? Oh, trying to escape. Very excited. I might have to just go and have a little look and see if it will play. Um, oh, is this the member specific stuff? Oh, here we go. So I haven't done my research at all. So this is Taehyung. So if anyone's got sugar, <laughs> hit a girl up. Um, and then we have, oh, I think this is a poster. And then a very thick photo book. Oh. Hello. Oh, I'm so glad that I have this now. Oh my god. Yes, yes, yes. So hopefully, fingers crossed, that will work in my um, player. If not, I think you can fi probably find it online. But I haven't actually watched it, so <laughs> there we go. So here we go. So those are kind of like the... The new stuff that I've got. I'm not sure if you watched my, not my previous video, or the one before. I will just show this briefly because I am running out of time. Um, but I did get Wavy's photo book. Um, so this is, the, they came with like member specific versions. And obviously I got Yang Yang's because he is my bias. So we have some Yang Yang. This is probably just going to be a really long video. So I do apologise. <laughs> Um, we have some like member, like they're like member specific. So there's like a photo card and stuff in here. Um, I'm like, which way does it open? Um, so yeah, it's a little, little envelope. It says Yang Yang. And then there's just some like, I'll just take out a few a couple of bits. If you're interested, you can go and watch my video. But uh, I'm sure some of that stuff will go into a photo card binder at some point she says so yeah do you get some like random do you get not random you got some, like his like photo card set and then this is like a notebook with this dates on it you get some stickers and then this is all the members like posters like mini posters and then the photo book which is pretty thick so like i said i have got an unboxing on my channel if you are interested but there are quite a few of them out now i wanted to upload it i know i have I obviously opened it. I just no, I couldn't find any Yang Yang ones, and I felt sad because obviously he's not one of the more popular members. So I was just like, oh, I need to open it. That was my mentality. I don't know. And then <laughs> just randomness. And then I did get some random secondhand albums just because I had like some money left over, and I was like, oh well, worst on there. So I did end up getting um, these two versions of Itzy's Not Shy. They were really cheap on eBay. Someone was just selling them um, without photo cards or anything like that. And I only have one version. So I now have a complete album collection for Itzy. So that's very exciting. I collect yeah, these photo cards um, uh, very slowly. Um, but uh, yes, I was just like, I'd just rather have the albums so then they're done. I also bought um, this. I already have one version of Twice's Eyes Wide Open, but I really wanted this version. I didn't get this version because I got a random one. And I wanted to find one with my bias, Cheong. So we have some Cheong. And oh, I just love this comeback so much. One of my favourite comebacks of the whole year. It's so, so good. So uh, yes, yeah, so we have that one. 
And then the last kind of album thing that I got was Taemin's um, album. It's Act 2, um, Never Gonna Dance Again. Like, I just love Taemin. He's like my first K-pop love. So, you know, his music is just amazing. So I won't get all the bits and pieces out. But it didn't come with any photo cards or anything like that. I just wanted it for the music. So that was kind of it. Um, I do have a few random BTS related things. My sister, <laughs> she bought me a cushion. I don't own any K-pop um, cushions, but she bought me this one, which has certain someone's face on it. I can't really sort of share it, but I look, kind of opened it and looked at my husband and he was just like, that's not going on our sofa or our bed. I don't know what you're going to do with it, but it's a no. So it's going to go somewhere, <laughs> but it has Yoongi's face on it. So I do want to try and sleep on it, but I don't think my husband would really appreciate that. So that's kind of a work in progress. But yes, we shall see. And then I got this BT21 diary for next year. So that's quite exciting. We'll take it out of the plastic because I haven't actually looked at any of this yet. So throw the plastic away because we don't care. But uh, yes, I just bought, I just wanted it because it was 2021. So I kind of showed my sister it and she was like, oh, okay. So yes, this is a diary. It's too cute to like use though. So. You know, I'm very excited because Treasure have teamed up with Lime and created their own characters. And I feel like I'm quite tempted by... <laughs> I really like, like, my bias, like, characters. So, I'm like... And then the other thing to show you that's also BTS related and BT21 related is this Shuggy. Oh my God, I don't have, like, really very much BT21, like, stuff. So, I'm very excited. Look at me just ripping into this like this um so i have shuki and he's got like there's like three of them the whole gang kind of together so i'm kind of like is he all connected i think he's all yeah he's connected so i'm not actually sure where i'm going to put this because it will not fit on my shelf but hey ho never mind it's all good um so yes that's pretty much it the only thing i will show you is what's in this bag so this isn't like technically k-pop related but it kind of technically is it's filled with like stationery um like washi tape and like note cards and stuff is basically um i was making my my christmas list with my sister and she was like after some stocking ideas and i was like oh get me loads of washi tape um and she was like what's washi tape and i kind of showed her and she was like all oh, right so yeah she got me this <laughs> she gave me this one so pretty because uh, we run out of washi tape so quickly don't we um i got this she spends a lot of money on um like wish i'm very happy because this one's got like a diamond thing which is like reminds me of treasure so that's quite exciting but oh, so much pretty washi tape um, and then um, she got me this washi tape. It's like Van Gogh kind of style, which is very cool. Um, I think a lot of this is like available on Amazon. Um, and then I think that's it for like washi tape. But then she, she got me like these note cards and these note cards and these note cards and lots of like other bits i got more note cards i got loads of like pens like just little cute little pens with bears and stuff on like she just she just loves wish i think i got loads of stickers and like oh i got like a stitch pad because i love stitch so i got like that that's a stitchy thing and then she got me some like stitchy like notepad things i got more like bits of stationery yeah, loads of this is like um chaos. This is like a little cute sticker book. I can keep stickers in. I'm like, I didn't think I needed this in my life, but apparently I do. Um, she got me this like set of like pins and stuff, which I I'm not going to use or need, but hey, maybe I'll take them to work. Um, some ribbon, a really cute ribbon from Paper Chase. Hello, I just wow, and then just like some memo pads and stuff so this is what happens when you say to your sister just get me like a little bit of washi tape or something and a couple of like notepads she just goes crazy and just buys me the world 
I mean, I'm not complaining, but it's a bit, it's a bit much. I'm just like, oh, okay. But yes, there we go. That's my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, my next video, I've got a couple of things on the on the old go, so we'll be back up and running, I'm sure. But um, yes, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year. Please stay safe and happy. And here's to a 2021 that will hopefully be a lot better. Fingers crossed. Um, I love you all very, very much. Till next time. Ciao.